is pretty literal that that's literally all we have. Because everyone else is dead. Hey, this is kind of a nice touch. I wanted to just start jumping and stuff for no reason, and you can't. So that's kind of a nice touch. I don't know if they did that. Obviously. Must have done it on purpose. Fountain. Hmm. This is where they give you that expo ex position. <laughs> Exposition dump. It's been a lot it was a long day at work, lads yeah. and ladettes. <laughs> Exponential dump. <sighs> Question of the part, what's the game that gave you the biggest exposition dump at the end possible? We played one recently that kind of did in uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Kind of gave you a pretty big expedition. Ex oh, uh, expedition. E yeah, exposition. Um, Indigo Prophecy did that quite a bit. But I like uh, I like games where like there's like essentially no story, and then at the end it's like da -da 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 -da. oh oh here's a great one. It's actually a great game, Resident Evil One. There's like essentially no story after the beginning, and then you meet Wesker and he's and he talks for ten minutes straight. Yeah. That's a great one. I think one of the worst ones. I mean, it's even in one of my favorite games, but Chrono Cross does that, where they give you like a huge lore dump, literally the <laughs> screen before the final. Boss. <laughs> it's just like, hey, we didn't forget. Okay. Oh. I mean, it really feels because Chrono Cross is pretty oh. well known to be a rushed unfinished game what was up with square in the ps1 era i don't know saga frontier 2 it's like saga frontier as well excuse me it's just like them being like we gotta get it down in time and then they like and then five six seven eight years later they they were like oh final fantasy 13 it's not ready yet it's not ready and then versus 13 they're like it's not ready yet. it's not ready yet but in the ps1 era they were like just get it out bro yeah. Come it, was, on. it was definitely the uh, era of chasing the most highest end graphics, and it really affected them during that decade. Yeah, I mean, Final Fantasy XIII was in development for I beautiful mean, looking game, but Ten Two came out two thousand three, so just assume it, it was in development for five full years. It just it wasn't uh, worth it. Nope. Wait, you can't check on Babu. I don't know if she would like do something like no Made a deal with the devil. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, that's why uh, the beard took her. Yeah, this game's still going. I know, right? It's like, I want to, like... No, it's too late to cut now at this point. Let's finish in the next 20 minutes. Oh, and this shows you all your memories, but now it's gonna, like... Unmess them up. Oh my god. So it must have been drinking from that fountain of 
yeast or whatever. Or down. It's pretty interesting. I, I thought this game was. Oh, this is where he went. I thought this game was over. I mean, it's clearly pretty, pretty yeah, much I, over. I think. We'll stop for a second. Ooh, I can jump again. So, from what I understand, she had a chance to get out if she gave up the baby, but she didn't. So then everyone, uh, no one's died. Okay. I don't really care about sanity effects at this point. They're like, here's matches, bro. It's like, uh... Ooh. So they all blame her because he didn't give up the baby. She, excuse me, she didn't give up the baby. So is this God is the one that's like causing all this to happen to them? Or do they not explain that yet? Uh, I think so. Take it over the other side. Can I do that? We're just supposed to pull it out. No? Can I take it the whole way over? No way. It doesn't go any further than that. Okay. Oh, let's just put it over here. Okay. Can you just grab the cord from the base? No. Okay, so let's undo this. Can you put the Can you put that rope in one of those? Like in here? Oh wait, yeah, pro yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Good call. That's what I thought, but Ching. It's fine. must have opened a door up here or something. What's this? What's this? What's anything? Am I literally not going to beat this game today? Alright. Okay. So I'll just keep running back. This is... I want to... I just hide from it. I want to say this is the longest Frictional Games game. Maybe Soma was equally as long. I don't know. ka -ching. Nope. 
Go down the normal way. Up. Oh. Nope. Okay. Yeah, I think you're supposed to just go all the way back to the elevator. Oh yeah, this is supposed to happen. Ah. Free. Such a weird uh like cutscene. There's like nowhere to run because there was like no space. Bruh, get it. Yeah, I didn't expect that thing to go down the side pathway. Yes. Although probably it will. Oh. It's still there for the most part. Nope. Kind of going away. Okay. Nope. At least now we can just run up. Oh, talking about uh, protagonists that suffer a lot. Uh, the Wanderer in um, Shadow of the Colossus. Oh, it's, yeah. It's good one. Good, good one. Alright, so... Elevator's up here. Yeah, that's a really good one. I mean, especially by the end, like, by the time you defeat the 15th Colossus, you are just destroyed. Yep. Alright, so... Oh, I guess I go up the other elevator, maybe? That's what we were trying. Yeah. You can just go up that one again. Yeah, try it. Hit the button there. Maybe I'll work this time. Hopefully. <laughs> All right. There we go. I'd really like to finish this this sitting. I have a feeling that you're like physically done. Yeah. It's doing the exp exposition dump. I mean, definitely rational. I know the general thing is yeah, like... And you can definitely tell why uh, her companions hate her so much now. One life amongst many, I get it, but... You know? Her rationale for doing what she's doing is very uh I mean, it seems understandable. like they were like completely screwed anyway. Yeah. What I want to know is if the goddess caused the stuff to happen, or if the goddess was just like, I will help you if you help me, kind of thing. And then when Tassi didn't, was like, nah, pass. Oh my god, don't have any actual things to do. go home so i'll play for 10 more minutes if i don't finish then we'll just have a quick catch up next time oh god Killed the only good character, uh, the only not good character, the only character that's not messed up.
The child will be born with a sickness. It will waste her to nothing. Here with me, she can live. Here, there is hope. Hmm. I want to get closer to that thing in the background. Cool. First, I want to get close up of... Oh, come on, let me up. Aww. That's really cool looking. Very weird. I wonder what, like, if what was wrong with her kids is, like, a real-life thing that they based it off of. Because there's lots of really bad uh, diseases out there. Who the heck knows, you know? Yeah. Click to baby. Hold X to soothe. Uh oh. <laughs> wow, they actually did it. <laughs> wow. I didn't expect it. Well, there was nipples in God of War in 2005. So yeah, uh, I guess that's I'm true. Sure it's fine. Also, are you fine? Yeah, I mean, the, 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 uh, thing just said that she doesn't have much time because she's becoming one of those harvesters. So if there's a choice, do we leave the baby? So there's three endings from what I'm reading. You can either put the baby back in the crib. You can take the baby and run away uh, or you can kill the goddess I feel as if that you should do the third option but it also seems like it's the most complicated by far let's do the third whatever if we go a little bit over time who cares we also this got like is, 10 minutes left this goddess is a piece of crap like this place is a nightmare zone Okay. So you have to take that jar. Okay. And yeah, I don't want to like mess it up or anything. Leave. Yeah, I'll just. All right. Using the branches, moving from the ground as cover. Follow on your left towards the glowing doorway. So let's leave. Okay. 
mess up. Okay, so hold on. Uh, follow the wall on your left towards the glowing doorway. To the glowing doorway, run up the stairs, put the jar. Oh, in here. Okay, yeah, yeah, that was a little weird. Uh, approach the wheel. Oh, yeah. Uh, So ah, we... you're destroying her with this thing. Okay. Yeah, I don't even care if this is the worst ending. It's the most satisfying. Yeah, it's like... Because if you... Like, you can tell what happens. If, if you leave, it's just going to be, like, bittersweet. Because uh, you'll like survive and then it'll be like, oh, actually, you dead. Alright. We're gonna f uh, make your way back down to the left. You'll find another doorway, do the same thing. Makes sense, yeah. Come on, come on. That's a good thing, though. That's fun. <laughs> Is this the one? Uh, might I, feel be like, to I feel like that's not it, it. over there. To your right, to your right, 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 right. Yeah, uh, go up there. Yeah. Ah, I see. Thank you. All right. Wait, what? Huh? Oh, I guess that one's bad. Okay, whatever. Do I have any more? Oh, I do. Cool. You yeah, have just enough because you probably have to do all the time. Okay. Yep. And then there's a third one. This one looks like it's the furthest away. So you have to go past that door and then. That Oh. You probably need that, um, that power source. Yep, yep, thank you. Yo, yo, yo. Calm down, bro. Yeah, this this weird thing that just it survives off suffering normally, it doesn't deserve to live. Yeah, absolutely up that. Okay, so we can probably follow. Yeah, it's over. You should probably go against the wall. Oh, I guess that is black. Yeah. We good, we good. Actually, I can. <laughs> I like these weird things moving. Let's drop the phone. We didn't want that. Let's wait till this passes us again. A little janky. That's fine. Da, 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 da. Not a big deal. I don't even care if this is the worst ending. It's, it's, the, it's, most, it's the most satisfying. It's what you gotta do. Uh, okay. All right. And hey, you have just enough. Yeah, that's fine. Hey, who cares? <coughs> uh. Maybe I didn't. Oh. You did it. 
just in case. Now you probably just leave. Probably just die, oh, actually. Yeah, You are a weird thing that lives literally off of suffering. It doesn't matter. We were screwed anyway. At least it can't, like, kill anyone else then. You know? Well, that sucks. It's They're... like, even just being in this place, you, like, turn into a harvester. It's like, yeah. people are gonna suffer. Literally implied a baby died. Rip. I mean, the three endings, you gotta think about this. You gonna leave the baby here. Oh, what? Ooh. Oh, look at that face in the background. Yeah, all those, dude, all those people are, like, alive and being sucked. Yep. Whee! This is, I think this is the best ending. Pro I mean, yeah, what, what's the best ending you're gonna get in yeah. Amnesia game? It's either... Leave the baby here, and you turn into a harvester. Uh, you take the baby with you, and you turn into a harvester anyway. Or you just destroy everything. Or everything. But, like, oddly, like, killing that thing may makes this, like, red stuff go everywhere. And it's like, that kind of sucks in a weird way, too, but it is what it is. Yeah. yeah, I'm fine with that, because it's like, if you just leave, it's like, oh, we survived for five seconds. And then everyone else, like suffers you know yeah. forever or whatever it's like that entire place is like cursed or whatever is going on yeah it didn't seem like it was cassie's fault that they turned into harvesters no it was just them being there so yeah really solid game glad we finished it today yeah. um it, I, it's definitely the most um video game like of a frictional games game like it has the most gameplay and it also probably has the most um, in-depth puzzles, all things considered. I, would say so, yeah. uh, I wouldn't say it's the most story-based one. And based on my memory, I would say it's not my favorite one. Uh, no. But I quite enjoyed it. It's definitely better than Machine for Pigs. It's probably better than Dark Descent, because I played that like a couple years ago again, and I was like, oh, yeah. I don't like it as I much as I like remember. Soma than this I think Soma's probably my favorite, because I love that underground, that underwater stuff. Yeah. And I want to say that I like probably Penumbra better, uh, even though they're a little bit older. It's been so long back. It, it has. I'll have to play those at some point. So let's see if there's anything at the end. James Henry Hank Mitchell. So yeah, overall, I don't know if this was here before. Custom stories. I don't know what that yeah, is. Yeah, maybe like users can. Uh... <laughs> don't warn me again for these reboot. Your workshop files. Quiet protagonist. What? She doesn't talk. <laughs> That's so awful. The names are create the classic FG protagonist by removing the majority of dialogue spoken by Tassi. Making minor adjustments to the story. Interesting. Huh. Exploration mode. Like, oh, I should have played this. The wuss mode. Explore the world at its own pace without fear that last Tassie losing her mind. Uh, not final work in progress. Yeah, so this is all community stuff. Oh, that's cool, though. I didn't yeah. realize that that's a thing, that they lean while moving. Is that just it? <laughs> Some model is to lean while moving, just like in previous frictional games titles. Wow. Curse Temple. Oh, cool. Oh, that's neat. So, yeah. yeah. Overall, solid game. Like I said, if I had to place it, I would probably put it... Yeah. Third or fourth, depending... Uh, Soma's probably... Soma, and I want to say one of the Penumbra titles will probably be first uh, and second. But then this probably third. Yeah, so, yeah. like I said, overall, really good. The only bad game they ever made, and I don't... I think it was outsourced. It was. Was Machine for Pigs. So, that was outsourced, and it's just not very good. I think so. Machine for pigs was made by chinese room I, that sounds familiar to me okay but yeah go ahead and just buy any frictional games game give them a little bit of hope and maybe they'll be able to make more like this thank you much for watching and we'll bring more to you soon have a great day